Hello everyone and dear children. Welcome back to the channel. Today in this video, I am going to explain odd and even numbers for the primary school children. Objectives of the video lesson. Children will be able to identify an even and odd numbers. And children will be able to identify whether a set of objects is even or odd. Look children, here few students are standing in a class. Can you count how many students are standing? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9 and 10. Now we see whether 10 is an odd or even number. So if two students come together then they form a pair. So if students could be paired up then they will get partners or friends. Children let us see all the students could be paired up evenly or not. Yes, all the students have been paired up evenly. Does everyone has a partner? Yes, you are right. When all the students could be paired up and if they can able to get partners, then 10 is an even number. What would happen if there were 9 students standing in the class? Would everyone having a partner? Now let us see whether all the students could be paired up evenly or not. Does anyone left over? Yes, one of the children will not have a partner when you pair up 9 students in the class. Who is the odd one out in the class? Yes, he is the ninth one. Is 9 an odd or even number? Yes, 9 is an odd number. Now let us see what would happen if there were 8 students in the class. Have all the students been paired up? Yes. All the students have been paired up with no one left over. Then tell me children, is 8 an odd or even number? Yes, 8 is an even number. Now let us see what would happen if there were 7 students in the class. Let us pair up all the 7 students. Have all the students been paired up? Does anyone left over? Not all the students have been paired up because a student will be left over without a partner for the number 7. Now tell me children, is the number 7 an odd or even number? Yes, 7 is an odd number. Now what would happen if there were 6 students only in the class? Let us pair up all the 6 students. Have all the students been paired up? Yes, all the students have been paired up. Does anyone left over? No one left over. Now tell me children, is the number 6 odd or even? Yes, it is an even number. What would happen if there were only 5 students in the class? Now let us pair up all the 5 students. Now tell me children, have all the students been paired up evenly? Does anyone left over? Yes, one of the student does not have a partner to get paired up. Now tell me children, who is the odd one here? Yes, fifth one is the odd one. Now tell me children, is 5 an odd or even number? Yes, 5 is an odd number. Now let us see what would happen if there were only 4 students standing in the class. Would everyone having a partner? Yes. Tell me children, have all the students been paired up evenly? Yes, all the students have been paired up evenly. Then tell me children, is 4 an odd or even number? Yes, you are right. 4 is an even number. Tell me children, what would happen if there were only 3 students in the class? Have all the students been paired up? Does anyone left over? Yes. One student does not have a partner for the number 3. So 3 is the odd one out in the class. Now tell me children, is 3 an odd or even number? Yes, you are right. 3 is an odd number. Now tell me children, what would happen if there were only 2 students standing in the class? Have all the students been paired up? Yes. All the 2 students have been paired up. Then tell me children, is 2 an odd or even number? Yes, you are right. 2 is an even number. Tell me children, what happens when only 1 student stands in the class? How many students do we require to form a pair? Yes, you are right. We require 
two students. So can we form a pair with only one student? No, one student does not form any pair. Then tell me children, is one an odd or even number? Yes, you are right. One is an odd number. Finally, what are the odd and even numbers between 1 to 10? Children, look at this table. You can read the odd and even numbers in this table. Now tell me children, what are the odd numbers? Odd numbers are 1, 3, 5, 7 and 9. What are the even numbers? Even numbers are 2, 4, 6, 8 and 10. Children, what is the ending number in the number 10? Yes, it is 0. So, the even and odd numbers end with the following digits. Look children, the even numbers end in 0, 2, 4, 6, 8. And the odd numbers end with 1, 3, 5, 7, 9. So, all odd numbers end with 1, 3, 5, 7 and 9. And all even numbers end with 0, 2, 4, 6 and 8. Now tell me children, is 11 an odd or even number? What is the ending number in 11? Yes, you are right. It is 1. So 1 is an odd number. So 11 is also an odd number. Next, is 12 an odd or even number? What is the ending number in 12? Yes, it is 2. Then is 2 an odd or even number? 2 is an even number. So, 12 is also an even number. Now, what is the next number? It is 1, 3, 13. What is the ending number in 13? Yes, you are right. It is 3. Then, is 3 an odd or even number? 3 is an odd number. Then, 13 is also an odd number. What is the next number? It is 1, 4, 14. Now, what is the ending number in the number 14? Yes, you are right. It is 4. Is 4 an odd or even number? Yes, you are right. 4 is an even number. Then, 14 is also an even number. Because 14 is ending with 4. The next number is 15. 1, 5, 15. Here, the 15 number is ending with 5. 5 is an odd number. So, 15 is also an odd number. After 15, what is the next number? It is 16. 1, 6, 16. The number 16 is ending with 6. 6 is an even number. So, 16 is also an even number. What is the next number? It is 1, 7, 17. 17 is ending with the number 7. 7 is an odd number. So, 17 is also an odd number. What is the next number? It is 18. 1, 8, 18. The number 18 is ending with 8. Since 8 is an even number, so 18 is also an even number. What is the next number? It is 19. 1, 9, 19. 19 is ending with the number 9. 9 is an odd number, so 19 is also an odd number. What is the next number, children? It is 2, 0, 20. Now tell me children, is 20 an odd or even number? What is the ending number in 20? Yes, it is 0. Then tell me, is 0 an odd or even number? Yes, you are right. 0 is an even number. So 20 is also an even number. Look at this table children. Finally, what are the odd and even numbers between 11 and 20? Now read the odd numbers between 11 and 20. 11, 13, 15, 17 and 19. What are the even numbers between 11 and 20? 12, 14, 16, 18 and 20. Now look at this picture children. How many ducklings are seen here? Yes, there are 11 ducklings. Then is 11 an odd or even number? Yes, you are right. 11 is an odd number. So, there are odd number of ducklings seen here. Look at this picture children. How many sunflowers are there? Yes, there are 8 sunflowers. Is 8 an odd or even number? Yes, 8 is an even number. So, 
an even number of sunflowers are seen here look at this picture children how many cherries are there yes there are 10 cherries is 10 an odd or even number yes it is an even number so even number of cherries are seen here now children look at this picture how many pairs of flowers are seen here yes there are seven pairs of flowers and one unpaired flower so if one of the flower is unpaired then is it an odd number or even number if there are unpaired objects then it is an odd number then totally how many flowers are seen here there are 15 flowers is 15 an odd number or even number yes you are right 15 is an odd number so odd number of flowers are seen here look at this picture children how many pairs of socks are seen here yes there are three pairs of socks are seen here then how many total socks are there there are totally six socks is six an even or odd number yes six is an even number so even number of socks are seen here so even numbers are whole numbers that can be divided exactly into pairs whereas odd numbers are whole numbers that cannot be divided exactly into pairs now have you understood children what are odd and even numbers and how to identify odd number of objects and even number of objects okay children i will meet you in the next video with another topic until then keep watching my channel hope you all like this video thanks for watching this video Please subscribe to my channel and click the bell icon for the latest updates. Kindly give your valuable likes, comments and shares. Thank you friends.